They're gone, sir. The cells were empty when we were taken hostage. I should have known. Damn it, I should have known. Round up the last of the rioters and lock them up. Yes, sir. Missing? We have to get out of here. We'll be butchered. You may rest at ease, Mr. Hobson. I don't believe they're anywhere on the island. The riot was a diversion, orchestrated by Turner. As long as he's at large, Albion is under threat, Your Majesty. But he isn't the only one we need to worry about. We will need to recapture all the SKPs if we want to safeguard the kingdom. Who are the others? Professor Faraday was a celebrated inventor, and the brains behind most of our industrial progress. Until he turned on your brother. He's a mild-mannered man, but his creations could bring about the end of civilization. Mary Godwin, also known as Witchcraft Mary, was a highly skilled alchemist, though that knowledge rests in a very disturbed mind. She was convicted of witchery after they discovered her rather horrific experiments. I dread to think what she may do next. And I've already told you about General Turner, the most dangerous of them all. He must have been planning this breakout for months. Where do we begin? The records room holds all the information we have on our prisoners. My men can study the files for Witchcraft Mary and Turner. I'm confident I know where I can find Faraday. There's only one place he could call his home. One place he could believe himself safe. I propose we sail there as soon as possible. I magnanimously offer my services in this investigation. This study seems it's like a nice, safe place from which to serve the kingdom. Very good, then. Your Majesty, I shall meet you at the pier when you're ready to hunt down Faraday. There seem to be several entries on this Mary Godwin. Bollocks. I've made errors in the count before, but never had this many men missing. No other explanation. They've scarpered. Oh, bollocks. Brilliant. Knowing you're on the job, I'll be much more focused on the task at hand. Making sure this place stays locked up tight. I'll just say, be on your guard. One of these brutes won't beat the man. Faraday had a remote factory he opened up to the public before things turned sour. Clockwork Island. It was quite a popular tourist attraction some years ago. Faraday's inventions have changed the world, but all he really wanted was to make people happy. Why was he locked up? Nobody really knows. 
Your brother said he was a danger to mankind. As for Faraday himself, all he would ever say is that he'd rather die than betray his creations. I used to queue up for hours when I was a child in Bowerstone, just to get a glimpse of his contraptions. I still remember the slogan, Faraday Industries, where far away dreams become reality. Well, those dreams certainly look far away now. in front of the children. Now, if you will follow me, we will begin the tour. Keep your belongings with you at all times, and try not to stray from the group. I suppose we should do what he says. We begin with what is yet to come. Astonish your senses, give flight to your fancy, by stepping into the street of the future. I'm starting to wish I'd paid this place a visit while it was still open. Before you is an everyday Bowstone suburb, as it will be 15 years from now. Yes, the future is in our grasp. Please walk among the citizens of tomorrow, share in their joy. Marvel at their superior well-being. Who is Edward? In the world of tomorrow, there is no conflict, no jealousy, no selfishness. Thanks to science, people are finally happy. of these model citizens. Marvel at the perfect lives they lead. Would you not want to raise a family here? Good morning, good morning, good morning, good evening. This is the future that Faraday Industries can bring to Albion. Peace and contentment for all. Yeah. 